Hello friends, welcome to our next episode of How to Stay Warm in the Winter. For this episode, we are going to be talking about exercise. And I know some people don't like to hear this word, it can be daunting to them, but it doesn't really have to be. It can be fun. So if you are interested in this series, please keep watching. Hey friends, so today we're going to be talking about exercising and using this as a way to stay warm in the winter as a raw vegan. Now my name is Rhonda and if you're new here, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can stay notified to my next video. And again, welcome. Welcome to my videos and my channel. And today we're going to be talking about exercise. And like I said, exercise does not have to be you know, three hours long, it does not have to be, you know, strenuous, it does not have to be, you know, something that you dread. It can be very simple, not time consuming, and it can also be uh, fun. So um, let me give you some suggestions as to what I do that you can also do to stay warm in the winter. So one thing that I like to do is when I'm at either in the office, when I used to work in the office, I haven't worked there for like maybe a couple of years now, but while I'm here at, work, at home in, the, in my office, I have a couple of them, but when I'm there sitting down or even if I'm watching TV or um, whatever I'm doing, if I get cold, what I like to do is I just like to get up, just get up, and I just like to start moving. Like maybe what you can do is just like run in place, or just like walk in place. It doesn't have to be long. It can be like maybe anywhere between, you know, three to five minutes. And this will definitely get your blood circulation moving. It'll help to keep you warm. Another exercise that I like to do is something that I think is very fun. And I know that most of us as a kid, we had or knew people who had trampolines and we would jump on them. And that this was something that was absolutely fun for us. Well, there's a rebounder that is actually pretty cheap. You can get it anywhere from like $130, somewhere around there. I think that's about how much I spent for mine. And it's really fun. All you do is get on it. It's this very small trampoline. It doesn't take up too much room. And you can jump on it. And this will help keep you warm. Now the Rebounder comes with DVDs, at least mine did. But if yours doesn't, what you can do is you can go online and you can go to YouTube and search um, for maybe rebounding exercises and a lot of videos will pop up and you can do the videos that are there on YouTube and they're for free. They're there for, for you for free. So you can do that and this is some very light, it can be more intense, there are more intense exercises, but you don't have to do those. You can just do, you know, just jump in place, you know, this will help you. Look, we're just here talking about, you know, staying warm. So just jumping in place, you know, like I said, for a few minutes, this will really help you to get warmed. And it will give you tons of energy. Another exercise that I like to do that I, that I think is fun and does not, you know, take up a lot of time is walking my dog, Sammy. I like taking him out for walks. Usually when I take him out for a walk, it's for anywhere between, you know, 15 to 20 minutes. And I take him out maybe twice, sometimes even three times a day. And this isn't, um, you know, time consuming. It's not a lot of time, but yet it warms you up. When I come back inside, especially from being out in the cold, walking my dog, when I come back inside, it feels actually pretty hot inside the house. <laughs> so this will definitely help with keeping you warm. So we all know that body movement or exercising is beneficial for us in more than just keeping us warm. So body movement and exercise can help better your digestion. It improves your cardiovascular. It helps you to get a better, better sleep at night. It helps you to um, be able to stay warm, of course. It gives you more energy. And it can also help you with weight loss if that's one of your goals for this new year. 
So before we go on, I just wanted to remind you not to forget to go down below on the, on the description box. I have there for you a free ebook. If you haven't gotten that, don't forget to get that for you. And I hope you guys enjoy that. Also, um, don't forget to subscribe and hit like if you like this video. Again, exercising does not have to be hours long. It does not have to have to be something that's very strenuous, you know, with working out with weights and stuff like that. Although body uh, resistance, you know, working out with weights can be very beneficial, especially in your older age, because it helps to build your, it helps to make your muscles stronger. And, you know, it, it, it uh, reduces inflammation in the body. So that is beneficial, but you don't have to do that to stay warm. Again, in this video, we're just talking about being warm. So just moving your body, getting up, stretching, you know, doing a little uh, walking in place. You don't have, you don't need a rebound. You can just walk in place. You can just run in place. Um, you know, move your move your arms around, and all of this, all of these little body movements will help keep you warm. So, like I said, it, it it's not. It's not bad. It's fun. I think it's fun. Anyway, so I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to hit like if you like this video. Have a great one.